Should I blow your face again? Yeah, you don't have the rights to my likeness still. Yay! Yay. Did you had a good night at the Joiner's Arms? I don't arms. know which camera to look into. I'm all free at the same time as the Just look in the general direction of the cameras. <laughs> It's 12 o'clock and I haven't filmed anything here, so um, great vlog, good job. Tom, what should this week's vlog be about since it's not going to be about um, going to Lincoln? How shit your company's going? Oh, dab. So obviously not in the office right now. I am at a hotel at the Swan at my alma mater, University of Lincoln. Um, this one's like the student pub on campus and I thought I'll get a room there, it's only 40 quid. There's an absolutely lovely view just over there. That I wish I could set the camera like I usually do in the office where like daylight slicing me but um there's nothing on the window to like put it out the office is like this perfect groove right where I want to talk and yeah anyway my hair's wet by the way not greasy um I just showered I need to leave this room in about 20 minutes so I, I, I need to record the video here and I can't go back to the office and do it because it's it's relevant to the environment so yeah so this weekend was uh, the first game jam of the year for the University of Lincoln Game Dev Society and simultaneously the first hackathon of the year for the Computer Science Society. Um, last year I was the president of the Game Development Society and I ran it in my third year. And this year the vice president of Game Dev from last year is going to be vice president of CSS. Um, so it's all kind of still, the, 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 everyone's still connected, everyone still knows each other, which is nice. It's not like walking into somewhere and it's completely different people. I thought, no, I have to do this one because if I don't do this one, I'm not going to do any of the other ones. So the weekend, the jam itself was fantastic, um, as always. A great group of people, really nice kind of vibe, a nice buzz in the room. Um, I didn't sleep at all. Literally yesterday I got dinner with my old housemate Joey um, and his wife and we just we had dinner. And we came back up here and chatted for a bit and I honestly fell asleep about four times, like, for real. I was sitting in the um, in the pub yesterday, we were having downstairs, we were, we were eating, and I was like, guys, guys, I'm not. So no, it was a really good time, but um, kind of what I want to talk about is the experience of going back up to, um, back up to Lincoln, and a place that kind of left on uncertain terms, seeing people again, especially after that video I made last week, where I was talking about how much I missed everyone. Um, and something that's really come to me recently is this kind of idea of, how different life is when you're working compared to when you're a student. At the moment, you know, I wake up around 6.30 every day, um, get into work, leave about 5.30, get home about 6.45, which is usually just enough time for a quick run um, to eat and then watch a couple shows and then sleep. And I love my job, so it's fine. But compare that to student life where, you know, you wake up kind of 10 or 11 o'clock, maybe later, you go to an hour, you sometimes go to your hour or two of scheduled lectures for that day um, and then you go home and just play games for a bit and then in the evening maybe you go to a pub or maybe you go out you know every single day and I think from a, a vlogging standpoint from like a video a YouTube standpoint it's more interesting as a student and one thing that I really struggled with recently is picking up this channel again and trying to do weekly videos and realizing that I just have to talk because there's nothing to show that I work during the day and that's not particularly exciting I could talk about work and that might be interesting, but like for no more than two or three minutes. And I felt kind of bad because before it was like, doing this, doing this, doing this, doing this. Ugh. And I think that was more interesting. So that's part one is this is different um, from like a YouTubing sort of thing. Um, the, the other part is I'm so past this. <laughs> Coming back here has been a great time and I intend on doing it again, but it's kind of offered me some closure on what I kind of felt like I was missing out on. I was like, well, I'm not a student anymore. I work every day. I miss just hanging out with friends every day. Um, I think just kind of being a bit of a dos. And I don't actually, I thought I did. Um, but there's a stability. There's a stability to in a, in a routine. It's a lot of fireworks, Chris. Yeah, like You excited to set fire to things? I am indeed. Excited for boom, boom? Boom. Great. When you come out with sea cold. I don't get it. Is that it? <laughs> oh, I'm getting a scare. I'm getting a scary orb. Oh, oh, oh. Scary orb. The orb's gone. <laughs> Where's Virginia? Virginia. Take me home, country road. 